Innovators Under 35 is a project that started 15 years ago at MIT. We wanted to find the most inspiring and game-changing people in the world. So for 15 years we ran this program and we realized that there was a community of innovators outside the US that was underrepresented. So six years ago we decided to start organizing local editions of Innovators Under 35. Innovators under 35 was a surprise to start with and it's important to have a community of uh, fast, uh, vibrant and disruptive thinkers that are able to address those problems and maybe to catch those opportunities. It was very nice to have been included in that community. Uh, I think after the event um, uh, last May in Brussels we got a lot of attention from the media. This is the very first time that we run a summit. Uh, a gathering of all the innovators in Europe. And today we want to accomplish two things. The first one is to really connect this community, to build a really powerful community. Yeah, it's fabulous. Actually, yesterday I was just browsing the web, you know, looking at everyone who's, who's attending the, the summit today. And um, I, I really felt really, I, I mean, I appreciate it a lot. I feel really glad that, you know, so many incredibly smart people are coming to one place. Yeah. I liked really the activities you know, like I have met a lot of, of people a lot of interesting people that that plays uh, important roles in the politics and in science I think it's important because um, it's a way to meet uh, a lot of other innovators not only from France but from the rest of Europe one of the things that I find most interesting is I have very few um, occasions to actually uh, reach out and engage with entrepreneurs outside of my own ecosystem in Paris. And talking to European innovators is actually very important because we face quite similar issues and we also face quite similar opportunities. The second thing we want to accomplish is to really put the innovators on the stage to raise the awareness of how important innovation, entrepreneurship, science and technology are for the future of a region like Europe. We are here in the European Parliament, so it's opportunity for us to be listen. So yeah, I'm really happy to be part of this experience because the, you give me the opportunity to, to talk and, to, and you give me the voice to go to the parliament and to, to say what I really think, right? I think it is a very good idea uh, to have this community which gives us the opportunity to discuss our ideas and also to um, put it into account in uh, the European Parliament. I hope or I, I expect that uh, our new ideas of, of, this, of this community will be listened and actually there will be an action point. I surely hope that we keep in contact and that we will try and, and we will continue developing common projects and, and, and new ideas together as such realize um, truly trans-European innovation that will be of the benefit of society, for the benefit of society for many years to come. I, I really hope this community grows in the next year. I expect uh, this community to keep tight links and keep networking. All the innovators that you look in the back in the history, they were actually from here. So we should be proud of it and we should try to think how we together can achieve something special. And I feel it was a beautiful opportunity for all of us to get to know each other and to start thinking across uh, different problems that are facing the European Union now. <laughs>